time to time we receiving uh, split beans uh, already split uh, on the way from farm to our facility and I want in this video I want to uh, tell uh, how we uh, treat them uh, to keep uh, all uh, contains inside the beans uh, first of all uh, I want to tell that uh, split beans it's a sign that uh, uh, we using uh, only uh, ripe beans and uh, already old and contain <coughs> the highest level of vanillin and other uh, aromatic oils. Upon receiving, uh, we uh, first of all uh, separate, uh, select uh, beans uh, by size, well, actually by thickness, uh, and uh, separate split beans uh, from uh, others because uh, actually split beans uh, uh, we don't need uh, uh, to uh, to scalp they don't need to be scalped uh, scalp, uh, and uh, they going uh, right uh, for fermentation so this process might take several hours and uh, we have to uh, uh, finish this uh, this work as soon as possible uh, because uh, before scalding uh, beans uh, uh, keep developing and splitting once we uh, separated split beans uh, we uh, bond them or uh, tie with uh, uh, this raffia thread Raffia strings uh, to keep all seeds and uh, actually oils uh, inside uh, uh, into the beans and also uh, this operation uh, helps uh, to prevent uh, drying too fast. This operation it's uh, uh, like involves uh, yeah, uh, uh, high labor work, uh, high labor expenses, uh, but uh, still we uh, doing this uh, because uh, we want to provide the best quality we can. <laughs> And then, uh, when it's already all tied, uh, we're preparing them for fermentation. Yeah, all these beans, uh, despite the split or um, broken, uh, anyway, they are uh, going through all the same stages as uh, uh, normal ones. Uh, so they are uh, being uh, treated as uh, other beans, uh, so they uh, contain uh, uh, all uh, vanillin and uh, other aromatic oils and uh, the, uh, all these uh, stages uh, of the drying process and preparation process uh, make uh, these beans uh, oily, smooth and, uh, no, let's say, moistured. So, uh, as long as these uh, beans are already opened, already split, uh, we cannot uh, uh, scald them because uh, if we put uh, these uh, beans, uh, opened beans, uh, into the water, uh, some uh, seeds uh, and uh, other content uh, will lose in the water. Mm, so, 
uh, to prevent uh, losing uh, any of uh, the contents uh, we put uh, without uh, scalding directly to these uh, blankets and uh, uh, <coughs> uh, uh, store and these uh, uh, blankets uh, into thermal boxes uh, filled with uh, hot water so it uh, some uh, analog of uh, scalding So this is the way we filling uh, eskies, thermal boxes with uh, hot water. is the way uh, how we preparing beans for fermentation and this uh, also takes takes time every operation takes its time This is the box when for fermentation. After fermentation, some bathing and sweating, and uh, finally uh, we uh, move these uh, beans to the trays, and uh, for the final stage of uh, drying process, it's conditioning. Uh, some uh, <coughs> beans that we uh, couldn't fix and uh, too open uh, uh, couldn't be tied uh, with uh, strings uh, we put uh, right on a uh, trays uh, to prevent them uh, uh, to not disturb them so this is how right being looks like.
it's already full of seeds and smells very good uh, so these beans that uh, too damaged uh, cannot be fixed uh, we lay down uh, lay out on trays and uh, in this uh, way right on the trays uh, uh, put on for sun bathing so we not disturb much uh, those beans and uh, after several um, days usually it's uh, about a week maybe 10 days uh, they will look uh, like this and uh, moved for conditioning to conditioning room so all seeds you can see they are here because we almost uh, didn't touch uh, during the drying process the beans so everything is here everything uh, can be used for uh, extraction and so on and these beans uh, contain uh, extremely high uh, level of vanillin and uh, other aromatic uh, uh, components these beans uh, we are selling as a grade B uh, but with uh, remark uh, that uh, uh, most of them are split usually uh, our clients uh, don't mind to buy these beans because they know uh, this is the sign that uh, beans uh, are ripe and uh, very good uh, for using uh, uh, for making uh, extract so this is uh, uh, these beans we sell as great B but as I said uh, uh, always we uh, notice our clients that uh, beans are split and of course uh, if they <coughs> don't want this and prefer uh, normal beans uh, of course uh, we don't sell this so we usually open uh, uh, to our customers and of course we uh, provide all information about our product uh, so uh, we don't want to I uh, feel them surprised and disappointed in our uh, product. Even we know uh, this is uh, these beans are good for fermentation and actually yeah the main purpose of uh, vanilla beans. Uh, of course we provide all this information and notice. <coughs> 